What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome back, my subscribers. I'm welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel, Leo, and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified to see the readings. This free journal clicks the reading for sign of Leo. This can resonate if you have um, Leo in any aspects of your chart. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Ortho, and Hammer to your chart. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. It doesn't apply to apply. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate. Leave the rest. Um, this is hashtag blow up for the sign of Leo. So this can resonate if you have Leo in any aspects of your charts. And I encourage everybody to check out their Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North Node um, signs for additional message or messages. Love and appreciate each and every one of you guys. Share messages you have from Leo. Um, all of July's readings are up, beginning of July and mid July. So just to let everybody know, they're all up, okay? Also, while I'm shuffling out, if everybody could think of me on July 15th, this Friday of this Friday, July 15th of 2022. I'd very much appreciate it. Um, keep in your thoughts, well wishes, prayers, or meditations, whatever you do on the religious side, spiritual side, or religious and spiritual side, whatever you do. Um, no judgments on religion here. No judgments, period, unless you're a thief or a pedophile, just saying. But um, I have a child custody battle on July 15th of 2022 with my ex-husband. It's not the first rodeo with him. It's actually more like the fifth, sixth, or seventh. I uh, lost count um, after so many, to be honest. Um, but um, he's fighting for custody of my two teenagers, um, or our two, two teenage, two, ah, I can't speak, of our two teenagers' um, brother. Um, it's just um, I understood the first couple times he took me in because it was child support adjustment. Um, because he. Um, his wife at the time was not an RN at the time, um, and I was. Um, I've been licensed, uh, licensed since 2013, working since, um, since since 2014. So I understood that. As soon as I got my first nursing job, he took me in for a child support adjustment. I, I got it. I understood. But then things started getting crazy. I mean, I'm one income, and he's not. So it just really irritated me very, very, very much. Um, but it is what it is. It is what it is. Um, but the last time he accused me of child abuse, the time before he accused me, um, I had a boyfriend. Um, I had a boyfriend the time before, which was six years ago. And he um, had my, manipulated my daughter. She was about 10 at the time. And manipulated her to walk around with the phone he had just recently bought her. And take photos of clothes that uh, I allowed him to keep at my house in a drawer and his toothbrush and toothpaste and razors and things like that to prove his evidence in the court of law that um, that he lived with me uh, to get me for contempt of court, basically. So um, that's just kind of the person I have to deal with, basically. It's really sad. Uh, people, hashtag live free. People should leave people alone, period. And that's just the truth. So if everybody just keep me in your thoughts and prayers and well wishes, I very much appreciate it. Okay. We have purity. Number 45 or 12 could be a very significant number in one's life. Number 45 or 12, it could be a possible age of you or somebody you're connected to or any other significant number. 45 or 12. Sarah Lacali, Queen of the Outsiders. I have survived. I am where I'll always be in love. The Void, Stop, Embrace Winter, Great Cosmic Bloom. When I merge my desire with faith, I can take action from a place of peace rather than control. Purity. A pregnancy is about to become very significant in Leo's life, and Leo is pregnant. Oh, that was quick. A pregnancy is about to become very significant in Leo's life, and Leo's pregnant. So, Leo Finn's pregnant. Um, whether she knows she's pregnant or not, I have no idea. I'm definitely not pregnant, but there's at least one Leo Finn out in the universe that is pregnant. Um, and for one of you guys, a pregnancy is about to become significant in your life. So I think it's somebody you're connected to is pregnant. Purity, that's the uh, pregnancy energy. You plug it in how it resonates. An innocence of a child 
um, for some one child, for some two, two plus children of the past, it's about to become very significant in Leo's life. And the innocence taken away of, for some Leos, one child, for some two, two plus children um, in the past, it's about to become very significant. So purity is the innocence in this situation, but it was innocence taken away. It might have been through um, child pedophile rings, community child pedophile rings. I've been pulling that crap in, so it might be. For some, it might be any other way. It might have been molestation. It might have been um, something worse. I'm not sure. Um, you have to plug it in however it resonates in your own life, Leo. Um, that's terrible. It's terrible. It's terrible. I was molested as a child myself. Um, and it, it's terrible. It's terrible. So I'm sorry for whoever that's for. The temple path. I feel for a lot of you guys, it's your children. For some, it could be somebody's children you're connected to. The temple path. Huge decisions coming up for Leo soon. Huge. Huge, important decisions. Huge, important decisions coming up soon for Leo. Huge, important decisions. So the temple path is basically the path you're going to choose. Uh, whatever path it is you're going to choose, Leo, um, everybody has choices to make. Now, whether it benefits your life or doesn't benefit your life or you go down a detour or, or you hit a tower or what have you, what have you, everybody has choices to make in life. And that's just the truth. The void, stop, embrace winter, great cosmic womb. A Leo is experiencing huge financial difficulties right now. Huge. They're not, they're not displaying this to the public, but they are. One has a horrible credit score. Horrible. One is $20,000 in debt. Oh my God, you plug it in how it resonates. My God, so you plug it in how it resonates. So financial difficulty here, if this resonates for you, Leo, one of you guys, I heard you're at least $20,000 in debt. My God Almighty. And one, you have a horrible credit score. So I don't know. Um, I'm assuming maybe 400s, 500s, 600s. I'm presuming. Um, whatever that is and how that applies, Leo. I'm assuming 400s, 500s, 600s. You plug it in how it resonates. But financial difficulties, I think, um, I think the void is like in the red. In the red here, bad financial um, health here. Um, whether it's the bad uh, credit score or the um, or the actual physical debt, like credit card or credit cards debt, how that resonates and applies. Okay, for some you could be depressed over this credit card debt is what I'm feeling. Um, you plug it in, how it resonates. Oh Lord, this is the glow up. Um, this isn't supposed to be not. This is supposed to be happy, happy, happy vibes, but that's what we got in here. When I merge my desire with faith, I can take action from a place of peace rather than control. A particular Leo is about to gain lots of peace in their life. Lots of peace. After a period of constant drama. Well, that's a good one. A particular Leo is about to uh, experience a lot of peace after a period of constant drama. So, whoever you are, Leo, I think um, you either free willingly put yourself around drama and chaos or it came to you. However, that resonates. Um, but however that resonates, um, drama and chaos and conflict energy, but soon you're going to have peace. So, that's good. Peace is always good for everybody. Sarah LaCalle, Queen of the Outsiders. I have survived. I am where I'll, I will always be in love.
A Leo feminine, high vibrational Leo feminine is a true survivor. A true survivor. Has survived so much. Unnecessary chaos. Soon she's about to get high on her. Unexpectedly. Well, that's beautiful. So a high vibrational Leo. Um, I heard you've survived so much chaos, unnecessary chaos and drama and what have you, what have you. For some, it could have been gang stalking, retaliation, bullying, etc., etc., etc. But however that resonates, um, I heard you've survived it. I heard it was unnecessary. So somebody did something very, very, very unnecessary to you. But I heard soon you're about to get high honor, um, high honor unexpectedly for it. So unexpected high honor for your bravery and your resilience and your determination to live, I'm presuming. Um, I heard it's unexpected, so you're not going to expect it, which honestly, that's the best way to um, receive high honor is not expecting it. Because um, it, to me, it promotes more um, gratefulness. Um, whoever you are, sir, man, um, you're high, well, you're man. I heard you're a high vibrational Leo Fib. So your feminine energy, high vibrational, you treat people honestly, trust, respect, morals, ethics, integrity, and value. Values, whoever you are, ma'am, um, how that resonates? Okay, let me see if I hear anything else. I've been drawn, I'm drawn to this card, so let me just see if I channel in anything else. Okay, I didn't. I didn't. Okay. Cassie, Casey, Jessica, Jamie. Cassie, Casey, Jessica, Jamie. Emily. Emily. Rhiannon. Rhiannon. David, Mark, Andrew, David, Mark, Andrew, Charles, and Charles. Okay, so that could be your name or somebody you're connected to's name, first, middle, last name, um, your name, somebody you're connected to's name, first, middle, or last name, nickname, you, you, what have you, what have you, you plug it in how it resonates. K, G, L. K, G, and L, too. So the initials K, G, and L. That could be your initial, first, middle, or last initial. Um, or somebody you're connected to's first, middle, or last initial. K is in kite. G is in great. L is in llama bean. So you plug it in how it resonates. Hope this helped. If you think anyone else would uh, like my channel with the psychic, intuitive, prophetic messages, please feel free to share it very publicly on your social media and word of mouth. Very much appreciate it. Love you guys so much and namaste.